kick scooters are fun to ride, easy to store, and let you zip around the city. But can an adult ride one with dignity? Okay, as a grown-up, you've had to swallow your pride when you ride. But once you experience how much faster it is to get around, it's tough going back to walking. They don't take up extra space on a subway or bus, and even during rush hour, you can hold one discreetly. And they don't require a lot of maintenance. While you wouldn't want to ride for miles on one, a scooter is perfect for that last part of your journey. For most riders, a model with a low deck and large tires makes the most sense. The large tires will roll right over cracks or other imperfections in the road, and a low deck means you won't have to bend as much with each stride, which is a lot easier on your quads. You also want a lightweight model that's easy to fold. There are only a handful out there that meet these criteria. The Razor A5 Lux goes for about 70 to 80 bucks. It's one of the lightest out there, just eight and a half pounds, and it's also the fastest to fold. The only drawback is the ride is a little bit jittery. The Micro Scooter Black weighs in at just 10.3 pounds and costs $200. Its unusually low deck makes the ride exceptionally comfortable. Last, we have the Zooter Roma for $269. At 9.4 pounds, it's the lightest in the Zooter line. Unlike the other two, Zooters have a front wheel brake that's convenient for controlling your speed down hills. The only drawback is the locking mechanism, which isn't as fast or cool to operate as a Micro or Razor. As an adult, you might feel self-conscious riding on one of these, but why should kids have all the fun?